In this balloonary review, I'm going to show you everything you need to know about this app. If you have any questions, please comment them below, and I'll also leave a discounted link so you can always get your money's worth for Balloonary. Balloonary lets you automatically generate digital ads based on your website's content. The first Balloonary step is it will ask you which website you want to promote. So if you add the website URL into here, and then go on scan website, and this will generate your business summary. The AI will then fill in what it's learned about our business. It will work out the business name and how it would describe our business. Now these might not be 100% accurate, so of course you can just type into here and fill these in however you'd want to. Once you're happy there, if you go ahead and click on confirm, and you can then pick a platform. So you can choose from Google, Facebook, Instagram, or LinkedIn. As it says here, if you're not sure which platform is the best match for your business, no problem, just pick one to start. You can always try other platforms later. So I'm gonna go for Google Ads and click on next. And this is now generating AI suggestions. Okay, so this is now giving us a preview of our Google ad. So we can first pick the headline. So we've got our own AI suggestions here. We've got support local businesses, grow your business, get the tools you need, learn from the experts and much more. Of course, again, you could just fill this in however you wanted to, or you could choose from one of these options. So I'm gonna go for grow your business. We then have the option of adding a headline too, where we could add another suggestion. We can then add a description. We've got the best place to find software tools to grow your business the best selection of software tools to help you grow your business, the best prices on software tools to help you grow your business, and much more. I'm gonna go for this one here. We are the most knowledgeable staff for software tools to help you grow your business. And then you can obviously go ahead if you wanted to and add another description or another headline. If we scroll down to the next page, we can see we've first got locations. So that's set to the entire world. We can click on the plus and we could add say the United Kingdom, the United States, France, Germany. We can type into the top, so I could go for Australia. And you can obviously add as many countries as you want. If you just wanted to go for English speaking countries, then you could just add, you know, UK, United States, Canada, Australia, etc. Or if you wanted to add Western countries, you could add them in here. The possibilities are endless. Below that, we have keywords. As you can see, the AI has some suggestions for us, or we can search in the top. So I'm just going to add some of the suggestions. Local business, business growth, business courses, business tools, local business support, business growth courses, business growth tools, local business growth. We then have the demographics. So if you wanted it in all languages, you could leave that on all languages. If you wanted it just on English, you could just select English. Below there, we also have our budget. So you can set this as either one-off or monthly. Here you can just select what you want your business to be. So if we go to the highest, 780, we can see that that should have around 16,000 impressions and 490 clicks. If we go less, you're obviously going to get less. As we can see, if we launch on Google Ads, an expert will check your ads. A balloonary ad expert will look over your ad when you launch to check the spelling, grammar, quality, policy, and targeting. We have no long-term commitment and great for quick tests. We can obviously go for ask an expert first to see what they think, or you can go straight ahead and proceed to payment depending on your budget. Next to Google Ad, we also have our website, and this just has information on whatever link we've given it for our website, and it shows that it's connected there. You can edit the page if you wanted to use a different URL, and we can also connect up analytics as well. If we go back onto campaign, this leads us over to the campaign overview. This will show our ad traffic only, or we can set it to show in all our traffic. So we can see we've got a Google ad there on our website. And if we click back onto the Google ad, this takes us over to the editor page. We also have performance tracking and ad runs. So once we've actually launched an ad, this data will show here. Below campaigns, we have ad runs. Again, we just have to launch an ad to see it run here. And below there, we have our payments for what we spent on the ads. On campaigns, we can see our one campaign here. And if we click back onto here, we can click on new ad. And here we could choose from Google, or we could try something different and do Facebook or Instagram. So if I went for Instagram, this will again 
generate our AI suggestions. And the same idea here, but it's just formatted a little bit differently because it's obviously Instagram. So we can build our ad creative where we could select an image from our website or we could pick one from the AI suggestions. So I could go for that one. It's worth noting as well that you can also search and it's linked to Unsplash. We can crop our image or if we're happy, we can go on next. We can then pick our layout. So we could go image and text or image, text and logo. So if I went for image and text, we could then add our text there. Again, we've got our AI suggestions. So I could go for that and use this design. We can also add our caption at the bottom. Again, set our locations, interest and demographics and our budget. This will also work the same for Facebook ads. If we wanted to create a completely separate campaign, we could click onto campaigns and go a new campaign. And that's just about everything. So what did I think of Balloonary? Balloonary was a fantastic application for generating digital ads. I was really impressed with how well the AI worked in regards to figuring out what your website does and suggesting different terms for the descriptions and titles. I also really like how you can have multiple campaigns for different URLs. Overall, I would definitely recommend Balloonary. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time.